our CNN chairs. They really want to hear you talk. Do they? We're going to read and answer some of the questions we've collected from the congregation, so that way we can give answers and responses to some of the things that people have been thinking about. <laughs> okay, so that's what you plan on doing? <laughs> yes, indeed, honey child. Now, what you should do is collect questions from this internet because I have enough questions to fill a whole show. Like, what do you think your young daughter is thinking? You know, the one that you abandoned in the home with your ex-wife who were also members of the Lighthouse Church? Yeah, I wonder what you think she's thinking watching you sit up here on this TV playing like you're married on this reality church house TV show. <laughs> now, that's my question. <laughs> oh, but anyway, y'all, hi there. I'm Professor Blackmore, and welcome back to my channel and to my series entitled Shani Girl. I hope you have a prenup. <laughs> and if you want to get caught up on all of the reasons why I don't think the decision to marry this reality show preacher was in Shani's best interest, please check out my entire series. And I hope you'll also consider donating to this video and my entire video series ministry by clicking the super thanks heart button below as well. And today I'm coming back to you to talk about the premiere of this money grab. Oh, <laughs> I mean this reality show wherein Pastor Mama's Boy, oh, I mean, Pastor Keon and Lady Shawnee declare and decree that they are going to read and answer questions they collected from the Lighthouse Church congregation so that they can make a whole TV reality show to give answers and responses to some of the things that people have been talking about. <laughs> And I just want to say to you, Pastor, that I guarantee you that you ain't answering the questions that people are really thinking about. <laughs> yes, indeed. I guarantee you that, honey child. But in Jesus' name, they are off to a great start in their quest to monetize this made-for-TV marriage by premiering their new VH1 reality show entitled Shani and Keon's Destination I Do. And just note whose name is first in that title, ladies. <laughs> yes, indeed, Lady Shawnee. Now, that is how you do it, baby girl. <laughs> and now, it will be a three-part special premiering on Monday, November 28th at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time on VH1 and also streaming on Paramount Plus. And the show follows Lady Shawnee and Pastor Keon along with their closest friends like, you know, T.D. Bishop T.D. Jakes <laughs> and all them Potter's House church folk over there and other family members as they prepare for their destination wedding on the sunny shores of Anguilla. And if you want to watch the full premiere, please follow the link in the description section of this video. But let's get a flavor for some of these so-called questions they will be answering. What stereotypes of the first family do you all want to break or disqualify? And I really don't want anybody putting a title on you because when you become somebody's first lady, they also have uh, the propensity to put a set of expectations on you. Right. I only want you to be my wife. And if you decide there is something in the church that you have a passion for, we'll find out what it is. But it's not a requirement. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, well, what do you see as your role in the church? I think that I'm still figuring that out. I, I of course, want to do something with the women, probably the kids, the other babies. Um, but I want to be the best wife to you. <laughs> Now, you can tell he damn well knows how church folk can be. Because from the moment that he announced their engagement, we were already sizing her up to see if she knows any church songs. Does she own a tambourine? Does she own a prayer cloth? 
Has she ever opened a Bible, etc.? <laughs> and I don't know how he thinks he's going to marry a woman and expect the church folk not to put the title of first lady on it. I mean, it seems very odd that he could be so naive. Oh, but anyway, y'all. <laughs> now, Shawnee states further, quote, I don't plan on conforming to anything that anybody expects. I just want people to see me as being authentic. I genuinely love to help people. So hopefully the Lighthouse Church will accept me as that, end quote. <laughs> All right. So in other words, what she's saying is, I don't know the first damn thing about being no first lady. My children don't know nothing about going to or belonging to no damn church. <laughs> and I hope y'all are right with that. <laughs> now, there was also a whole bunch of other warm and fuzzy stuff that was said that I just don't believe because I just don't see no love and no real devotion nowhere in this marriage. But as y'all know on here, I just ask and report and I let the saints decide. So what do you think about this reality show about this reality show? <laughs> do you think this man realizes that his child that he left in the home with his ex-wife is also watching him? And do you think Lady Shawnee will matriculate into a first lady Shawnee? Or does the Lighthouse Church even need or expect to have a first lady? Please let me know by leaving your comments in the comment section below. And I hope you'll also give me a big thumbs up. And I hope you'll also consider donating to this video by clicking the super thanks heart button below. And while you're there, I hope you'll also consider subscribing to my YouTube channel and click the bell so you'll be notified whenever I come back with even more hot tea drama on this reality show, Hot Mess of a Marriage, made for TV. <laughs> and please also follow me on TikTok and Instagram.